And welcome back. Leveling off screen. I know this looks like I'm actually... Technically, I'm already way over-equipped, if you want to call it that, especially with the Smolder Spear early on, since, as I said, that's pretty much the best item to give him as a weapon, and it's actually pretty easy to make to begin with. But we're level 10. Now, I gave him lots of Beast Fangs just to increase his power to, like... Uh, we're actually at 99 power right now, with the 63 plus the 36 on the side. With Umas, Smolder Spear, Guts and Glove, Wild Armor, and Gigi Gagavaka. She... I looked up the ingredients for things and learned that I could actually make leather cords myself, which was helpful because... I needed one for a wild dress, a wild bag, and a swish whip. And since I got her the wild bag early on, which is great, it's her best weapon. Swish whip was... Eh, it's okay, it's not necessary really, but it's helpful. And wild dress is the best armor that she can wear. I also gave her an O mask. Whatever. I was gonna give her more nose ornaments, because, as you can see, they increase her IQ. But I figured, you know, whatever, she's level 9. And if you look at her skills, she has Wave Wave, which is like a party heal spell. It focuses on her, but uh, six fields around her are gonna get healed. And the sexy tech, Lulululululu which is labeled Lala here, which is confusing, is, as I mentioned, a great skill for her to have, because it can easily hit for like 600 HP, which is actually the thing that makes the boss in this scenario super easy. But uh, Gori overall didn't change much. She got a few more Gigi Gaga Vaka, increases his speed and IQ, which... I don't know, I don't think the IQ is all that important. But he overall hits pretty decent. This is a cave where you have to proceed, and yes, uh, I did have to go in here already, so you kind of missed a scene. But it wasn't really anything. It was just uh, Zaki and the five stooges he had being stupid, and they went over here, but something happened behind there. But I had to because uh, random encounters do not respawn on this field. It's only if you enter an area, and that's the only area you can enter. And I needed that for leveling purposes. But you might as well continue. I'm not sure why he moved to that side. It's not like Bell was not on the side. You know, if you're hungry, we have several meaty bones. Ugh, gory. What? Uh...
Oh no! Belle got kidnapped! Again. Yeah, this is why you have to... Um... Why you have to make sure to level her up before you check the fire pit in this area. Because, spoilers, we aren't going to get her back until we get uh, to the boss of this scenario. Ow! So you definitely want her to get equipped and level up and everything before you proceed. And we're fighting Zucky again. Is that a fan in his hand, or is that red stuff on his chest just... chest hair? You know, rub sticks is actually a pretty good, uh, technique. No real range, and it takes a while, but certainly hits for a lot. Ah. Yeah, technically you would want to prevent getting hit it, getting hit by him, but it's Zaki, he's not that much of a threat. Even if I didn't have uh, several Beast Fang equipped. It worked, so... Yeah, whatever. No! Stupid ape. Am I dead? By the way, no, it doesn't matter which direction you run in. You just have to run into a direction long enough. Oh, Bill! This is the fun part. This is a dark area. And I can sort of tell where the stones are. But for the most part you have to orient yourself with your nose. Oh! That's the first time I've seen that type of enemy. Usually I just see gators in this area. But they apparently have high defense, so... High defense, not a lot of... ...attacks, so it doesn't really matter.
Uh, this is a problem if they interrupt you while you're busy starting your technique. You have to restart the technique. Gotcha doesn't reach. No reason why I needed to use Gotcha, which heals me somewhat, because you get healed anyway. At the end of each... Uh, at the end of each battle, anyway. of this area is we have to get to the wall that smells like Zaki. But the clouds tell us what is what. Can we get gators? Yes, we can get gators instead. That's lovely. You kind of want to stay away from their mouths since biting hurts a lot. But if you're kind of stuck there, it makes it difficult. area. Huh. 
there. Fun fact, after this part, we can do various things on this field. The first is that we can actually find the uh, King Mammoth, which I mentioned was a difficult, rare encounter on this field, and yes, it can only be fought after you have gotten out of the area. So no getting Belle in with her Lala that deals a lot of damage, or her healing technique. Though overall you shouldn't try to fight the mammoths until you're like level 16 or something like that. At least. There's also the face rock, where you're supposed to hit A 100 times and only 100 times, then there should be a new door open, and you give something a bone in there, and that gives you an item that's actually pretty cool. It's like a battle item, but... What the hell, Gori? Ugh. But it doesn't disappear after one use. I'm actually trying to avoid battles right now. That was stupid of me. But, oh well, I'm sure he can take, like, one hit from poison. It's not gonna kill him. Soda grain? What? Did I just get? Or was that a new skill? Oh, it's a new skill. Okay.
remember that that little tiny part there is where it's really difficult to avoid battles. And the thing is, if you flee from a battle, you are much more likely to... get into a battle immediately after again. So running away from battles doesn't really help all that much. already more than decently leveled and equipped for this area, so... Just bite him already! Yay, last guy... ...with whom we can create a few things if we still need them. As far as I know, we don't need anything else. Well, another got some love. But he can't equip that, and he's already got one. Oh well. But we do have 29 meaty bones and 8 giant ones, so... We have some decent items to... Oh, I thought we were already at the ritual part. Okay, Gori. You just... do that thing that you're doing. Oh, correctly... Yeah. Oops. Fortunately, the Ku Tribe guys here are pretty weak. So, you... Don't have to worry a lot about that. We have to move. I mean, the caves are good if you want to like level up a bit. But for the most part, I want to stay away from them all except for the right one. Ah! Stupid corpses in my way.
I actually wanted to finish the scenario in this video. But I didn't think it was gonna take this long. But I remember there's still a bit that we have to get through. Oh my god! Pink apes just showed me their boobs. Uh, this room. Enemies are gonna keep walking through the door up on top where we have to get to, and it's pretty much impossible to avoid the battles here, so... I'm gonna skip until I get through this room. Okay, and we made it through. I actually wasted a minute or two until I remembered that you actually have to go back and grab Gori before the enemies actually stop spawning after a while. But I did make it to level 12. Joy. Unnecessary, actually, but whatever. And we're fighting this guy again. Strangely enough, on our own, but... Uh, whatever. I swear he gets weaker with every time that you fight him. I hate it when they move. It doesn't really matter where we are on the field, we're actually supposed to stay away from them, but... Oh my god! What's with the... Blue cape.
Odo. Personally, I would have pronounced it Odo, but it is supposed to be pronounced Odo. There's a good reason for it. Yeah, Zaki is part of our team. It's. But let's have her strut her stuff, because that's what she's supposed to do. Honestly, if you have Belle's Lala, this is so easy, you could do everything just with her. Yeah, Zaki is part of our team. We can use the same techniques he's been using on us. But he's really, really weak. Like, yay, he's got that stuff, but doesn't really matter. Uh, let's have him use a bowl or whatever that does. Meh. You and you. You might as well eat something just to prevent you from dying. Not that it really matters during the during this battle. And oh, Dio is down. As said, he's really much easier with Lada. And yes, I should apologize most likely about the black things, but I haven't found a way to alter my settings to avoid that happening. I guess Zaki is sad because Blue Cape is dead. And that was a prehistoric uh, scenario. As said, if you want me to uh, go through a specific one next time, drop me a PM or comment or whatever. Otherwise, if I don't get anything in a while, I'm just gonna, I don't know, randomly choose which one. I uh, guess Zaki is now the leader of the Ku tribe. Unless we all form one big tribe now.
giggity? Ew. <laughs> Sweet. Yes, we can actually replay scenarios if we want, which is actually helpful if we want to, like, do the optional stuff or try out different ways. But scenarios that you can pick. The Mecha. The Ninja. The Chinese Kung Fu guy. The future one. The wrestler or the cowboy. Drop me a line and whatever gets the most, or the only mention, if you will, will get picked! <laughs>